the way I curl my bob, she was like, oh, you got an Oprah bob. <laughs> Oprah got money too, don't she? You know that he can't go down like me. You know that he ain't no free like me. So baby, tell me one little thing. How deep is your love for me? Okay, so as you can see, we already have this joint laid down. Got hair in my face, got hair in my face. Okay, so before we curl her up, let's go ahead and talk about the specs of this unit really quick. This unit comes to us from Victoria's Wigs. It is their 99J wine color 13 by 6 lace front bob. It does come in 8 or 10 inches. The 8 inch unit is $180.69 and the 10 inch bob is $189.79. I also have a coupon code Kai15 that will save you 25% off, okay? So that will be linked down below so you guys can use that as well to save some coin on this unit, which I feel like makes this unit very affordable, okay? If that's out of your price point, don't worry. You can go ahead and bypass this one. But if you are looking for a burgundy bob, you guys know I love me a burgundy wine unit, then this one can be for you. This unit comes with a 13 by 6 lace parting area, so 13 inches from ear to ear, 6 inches deep here in the middle. It also has two combs in the front, one in the middle, one in the back, and the adjustable straps. It also has the removable elastic band that's already sewn into the cap. So if you want to make this unit glueless, you can. However, the same issues I ran into the last Victoria wig, I ran into this one where I could not wear it glueless because the cap is so much bigger than what I need for my head. Y'all know my head is swollen every day, okay? It's swollen every day, but that 23 and a half cap was a little bit too big for me. But you know, whatever floats your boat, if you're able to make it work glueless, then you can do that. This unit does come with a pre-plugged hairline as well as I believe there are some bleach knots in this unit. The pre-plugged hairline is okay. You know, it gives you like a good start i chose to pluck it just a little bit but you know what i got tired i didn't feel like plucking so you know i'm hoping it looks okay for now i can definitely see that line of demarcation right here so if that bothers you what you can do go in and pluck it up okay where's my comb okay so today i'm going to be putting some curls in this unit we're going to try to do some kind of like big wavy type of curls i don't have a wand curling iron however i do have big bertha <laughs> She made her way back into the fray. <laughs> you guys saw her in my last Victoria wig video. She just makes me laugh because she's so big. And we are going to be curling this unit up in some big old curls, okay? <laughs> big old freak. Hey! I need my wax stick. Um, if you don't have a wax stick, I do have one linked down below so you guys can check that out. It's not the same one um, that this is. I got this in a package that I got. So you can definitely use the wax stick to relax this a little bit. Um, I did go in and wash the unit because it did have like a little bit of smell when I got it. So I wanted to, you know, get that out of there. Ow, I just burnt my finger. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know if my lace is laid down correctly. I didn't even put no powder around here or nothing yet. Let's go ahead and do that. We're just going to start curling. Big Bertha is ready for that work. Ooh, that's hot. That's hot. Should I put my glasses on? I can make sure I can see. Ooh, it's a little hot in here. It's a little hot. Is that air on? If you don't want to curl this unit, you can definitely just rock her as is, okay? You can straighten her out, do like a little flat iron thing and go. But you guys know I love curls, okay? I love me a curly unit. That's just what I like. What you doing in here, ma'am? The curls are meant to be really loose. Get loose. Ooh, ooh, get loose. That ain't a song. What am I singing? The hair is curling really nicely. If this color is too much for you, um, or if you don't like the roots in the unit, because obviously, you know, there's not like a natural root in there. It's just straight 99J. Um, if you want to darken the root, you can, but I think I'm gonna leave it as is and try to rock her like this. Oh, that's the wrong way. That is the wrong way. 
this little brush from Walmart is pretty, it's pretty nice. It's like a paddle brush mixed with like, you know, a bristle brush. Pretty cool. Never seen nothing like that before. I did not get no shedding or tangling with this unit when I washed her, which was very, very nice. Um, especially for this being a color unit. I also didn't get no bleed out with this unit. So I'm really happy with that. Thought I was seeing some short pieces in there, but I guess not. No, I am. There you are. Hey, just keep curling. Just keep curling. I will not pull too hard because I didn't secure this down, you know, with a lot of spray. Don't want to rip that lace off my face. There's no breakage in the hair either, y'all. Like, it's not like crunchy or nothing. So it's really holding this curl really, really well. The hair on the top of the cap is a little dense, so you will need to lay that down. I should have definitely blow dried this in the direction I was planning on wearing the hair, but since I didn't know how I wanted to wear it, I didn't do that. So that could have saved me a little bit of time, but you know, it's okay, it's okay. I keep burning myself. Let me put some little, little baby hairs going on right here. Use some of my Nairobi foam. Put a little bit of my edge booster on here. Swoop and swoop and swoop and swoop. Swoop and swoop and swoop. Swoop, swoop, daddy. Swoop, daddy. Swoop, daddy, daddy, daddy. I need a curl. I need one more curl. I need another curl right here. Let's keep that one right there. Let's keep that right there. Let that sit just a little bit longer. <laughs> The heck am I singing, child? Goodness gracious. Somebody called my little, the way I curl my bob, she was like, oh, you got an Oprah bob. <laughs> Oprah got money too, don't she? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that is it, y'all. This hair curls really nicely. I would definitely say go in and pluck the hairline up just a little bit more. Um, at least for my taste, it is a little bulky over here, but we're gonna go ahead and move past that, okay? So no need to harp on that. Hello? Hello? Yes. What are you doing? I'm filming. Oh. But this is how that's looking up close. I think that color is really, really pretty. To make it a little sexy, you can bring the little bang over a little bit. Do that little thing right there. But because I can't see like this, I gotta swoop her onto the side so I can see for this video, okay? But for my pictures, bow, she right down there. <laughs> Y'all know how I do, put that joint right in the face. <laughs> so um, I'm here for it, okay? I'm here for it. Me and my Oprah Bob about to go make some more munty. <laughs> Is the air on? Golly, I'm trying to look cute in my little sweater situation here and it's burning up in this joint. So yeah, that is all I got for you guys today. I think this came out really cute. I'm feeling this unit. I can definitely see me rocking her for the summer. Even though I decided to cut her up just a little bit shorter in the back. Look, if I do that little thing in the back like that. Ooh, wee, yes ma'am. The direct link for this unit as well as my specs will be listed down below so you guys can check it out. Shout out one more time to Victoria's Weeks for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.